House Democrats voted Wednesday to condemn the Donald Trump administration's support for a lawsuit that would entirely repeal Obamacare. The House passed H.R.S. 271, which condemns the Trump administration's legal campaign to take away Americans' health care. The resolution passed 241-186, with one Republican voting present. Eight Republicans supported the measure. Rep. Colin Alward, D. Texas, sponsored the bill. President Trump reignited the national conversation over the future of health care when his Department of Justice, Dodge, backed a federal judge's ruling that the entire Affordable Care Act, ACA, violates the Constitution and must be repealed. Nearly two-thirds of Democrats reject Mueller findings. After many congressional Republicans signaled that they have no interest in a health care overhaul, Trump said that they will vote on an Obamacare replace after the 2020 election. Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell, R. Kentucky, said that he is focusing on stopping the Democrats' Medicare for None scheme. During a National Republican Congressional Committee, an RCC, fundraiser Tuesday night, Trump said that Republicans will continue to lose elections if they run away from health care. We have to win, we have to take back the House, Trump said. What really lost it and really helped us lose it was health care because we didn't have an alternative. 